Hello viewers, welcome to my channel. Um, I'd like you to like my videos, share my videos and please subscribe to my channel if this video helps you. Now this is a tutorial on how to trade after or following the latest upgrade on every Chimo account. Now um, I'll show you how this works. My account was a VIP2 account and after the upgrade it is now a VIP3 account. So you click here and just to show you okay now you see my account is now a VIP3 account and I'll show you the advance credit that was given to me is now 180 US dollars so I go to my cash flow sorry my currency flow and here you would see the advance credit is 180 US dollars Okay, sorry. Um, I go to my go to your loans, and you go to my account. Click on loans, and uh, you would see amount need to pay is one eighty dollars. Now, when you look at the new retail advance credits, it should also be. $180 but uh, my research I just did I have been able to trade in the new retail area in which uh, the item is a uh, fuel saver card which is for $100 and which is why now you see my new retail advance credits is $80 now this $80 which is equivalent to 80 chai points is meant to be used to purchase in the wholesale section now in the wholesale section the fuel saver card has been discounted from a hundred dollars to eighty dollars and you would need to buy two which is forty dollars times two equals to eighty which is why I have the remaining eighty advance credit okay so now let's go and let me show you the purchase I made this morning and that's first one always when you go to the new retail that particular item is to be received by the center and you would see okay now there you have it this is what I'm talking about the one I clicked on is what I'm talking about now previously I used to buy the quantum ring and this is what you can see down here and as you can see it is sold but now as my account has been upgraded now I now have the opportunity to purchase a full saver card and as you can see here this is the date and the time and you can see it is in the new retail section and as you can also see now this is to be received by the center okay so the next step I need to go to the wholesale section and this is exactly what you do in the retail section as well so I'm not going to go back to the new retail section the same process you follow in the wholesale is what you follow in the new retail the only difference is that the quantity when you are in the new retail you leave the quantity as one but in the wholesale section you change the quantity to two which is what I'll be doing okay so now 
I'm going straight to the wholesale section. I click on the wholesale section and it brings me to the wholesale section. And like I said previously, I used to purchase the quantum ring because I was on a VIP 2 package. But since I'm on a VIP 3 package now, I now have to buy the fuel saver card. So I click on the fuel saver card. And there it goes. And like I said, it has been discounted. And because it has been discounted, now it is $40. Previously, in the new retail section, it would be $100. So whatever item you are buying, when you go to the wholesale section, it would be discounted and the balance which you have would be able to purchase two of that particular item based on your VIP package. Now this is a VIP 3 package if you are all familiar with this. So the next thing you do is you click on quantity 2. As you can see it has been highlighted. Then you click on picture. Now this has also been highlighted. Now when it comes to the quantity, you just click on the plus. It moves it from 1 to 2. Now as you can see, then you go and you click on buy now. Now this is processing. Now it says processed successfully. Okay. So it moves you. And um, this you only need to highlight your address as you can see my name and my address and still as you have been doing you click on deliver to me now this also has been highlighted now this is the item I'm purchasing and you can see the price and you can see the quantity and you can see the total price then you scroll down and you click on continue to pay calculated successfully now this should send me to where I need to input my payment password and please and please after you do this you need to exercise patience which is what I did I did exercise some patience and I think about an hour after I went back to check and I saw that the first order I placed has been processed successfully and it is to be received by the center. So now you scroll down and instead of clicking on chai points, you click on advanced credit. Then you input your payment password. Click on confirm to pay. Now, after this will be processed successfully or calculated successfully. Okay, as you can see, now this has been processed successfully. So the next thing to do is to go to, you move to the next step. And um, I just want to give a big shout out to Pesha Queen, Sharon. She's really, really done marvelous. Just a uh, shout out to her. Kindly like my videos, share and subscribe to my channel if this video helps you. 
And like I said, remember, patience is a virtue. So you need to be patient after you do the first or after you make the first purchase. So you click on my orders. Now when you click on my orders, as I said earlier, the first one I did, here it is. Now this is the time and the date and you can see it is in the new retail section now this one has been processed successfully after about 30 minutes to an hour and this is to be received by the center and this is the next one I have done or the next one I just did now this is the same process I followed now this also says uh, 2020 of December 2019 and if you look at the time it is 18 hours 26 minutes and 45 seconds and the first one was 17 hours 55 minutes and 57 seconds and this is in the wholesale section so the next thing to do is to click on pay now when you click on pay, it will redirect you back to the payment password. All you just need to do is you enter the payment password, then you leave it and relax for some time. You can come back and uh, check on it and by then you should be good to go. And that is exactly what I did and I'm still showing you. Okay, and you can see it has redirected me back to where I need to insert, insert my payment password and I just do that and wait a couple of minutes to an hour Okay, so since I've already done that, 